got Ibuki's in there. The signboard says diner. I guess I should try going inside. Huh? That looks like... Huh? Ah, it's you! So this is where you've been eating? Dumbass! I'm trying to eat right now! Go away, dumbass! Fikikiku suddenly started yelling at me as he held a hamburger in one hand. Wait... Hold on... Why is he here? He was at the restaurant. Why does he know about the new island? Oh my god. Hey, why are you here? How did you find out we can go to this island? <laughs> are you a monkey or something? You don't understand human language. Shut the hell up! I told you to leave me out alone when I'm eating. Jeez! Annoying person went out of their way to tell me. Annoying person? They have found this place. And now I'm eating here because I'm hungry. Mystery solved. You happy now? So get the fuck out of here and go somewhere else. Hey, about that annoying person. It's got nothing to do with you! Mind your own business. It's got nothing to do with you. Actually, it does have to do with me. I don't know what you're thinking, but we're all in this situation together. You're not the only one stuck on this island. We all have to work together. You should know that by now, too, so... Why are you avoiding us? <laughs> hmm. I ain't avoiding you bastards. I said not to rely on anyone. Not to rely on anyone? <laughs> that includes the Kuzure clan. I can still survive without relying on them. You actually- Don't misunderstand! Don't get twisted. I'm a Yakuza by blood. It's not like I don't want to head the family business someday. I just want to prove I've earned it. Prove I can tough it out on my own without relying on my clan. Huh. Plus, even if I fail, the clan will still be around. My sister would be happy to lead it. If a little sister- SHUT THE HELL UP! What? You brought that up yourself. Anyway. Anyway, I don't intend to spend any time with you guys. Nothing good can come of it. Nothing good can come of it? <laughs> Isn't that obvious? In this kind of situation, interacting with others will just shorten your lifespan. Huh? So... Right now, I can live for... To 102 because I am less interactive with people. Those idiots, Biakia, Teruto, are proof of that. <laughs> Plus, it'd be frustrating to be held back by affection when it's my time to kill. You're still saying Of that. course. Of course. I sacrifice the lives of anyone here that guarantees my survival. If you don't actually mean that, you're awful just for saying <laughs> Heh. You don't want to spoke to me without my permission, so don't get pissed at me. If you're so upset, you don't have to stick around. Fuck off. What the hell? It was stupid of me to talk to this guy like him. Jesus Christ. Oh, there's a bird there. Burger, good! The diner signboard is spinning. Spinning restaurant signboard on an uninhabited island is kind of freaky. That just means there's electricity. Chandler Beach. Chandler Beach? Remember that baby swimmer? Yep, David Schwimmer is totally in this island. A scream? That voice just now, was that Ibuki? Oh, I was kinda right, but she was in the beach. Fuck. Where's she at? 
A boogie? A boogie. Uh... Oh no 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 so I glanced over the beach where Abuki was playing her finger. They're just. No, 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 Against me? That's quite absurd! Huh? Had enough? You learned your lesson? We're done for! He's done it. Nekomaru in his ultimate move, Super Body Battle. It's in death. She's lucky she'll live in there five minutes at best. You sound so anime, it's insane. Like you're in an episode of Dragon Ball fucking Z. Sheesh! Kane, at your current power level, you can't even defeat a mere team manager. What are you saying? Why are you guys fighting? Huh? Oh, this is a fight. <laughs> it's a one-sided beatdown. Then why the fuck would you say that there's another killing happening? It's even worse. The rules of the sculpture of the state. Excessive violence is prohibited. Training! More violence. This is not a real fight. We're training. That's fair point. But it'll look like a real fight. Hajime, do you even know what the difference between a real fight and training is? Huh? I'm just a team manager. There's no way I'd be able to fight for real. Training! We've agreed to this training session. I'm not violating any rules at all. Even so, why the sudden interest in training? <sighs> I gotta admit. What the? She's alive. Fool. She's not weak when you get killed by a weak bull like that. <sighs> she looked pretty strong, so I couldn't help but get excited. I thought sparring would help me burn off some of this energy, but I lost. <laughs> More importantly, that's a lot of strong dudes in this world, huh? Aww. A bunch of battle-loving troublemakers. I see. Kane, it seems you're the type who learns low actions rather than words. So I shall give you just one piece of advice. How how you use your body and muscles, your positioning and your timing, it's all half-assed. You are not utilizing your ultimate gymnast talent well at all. Pay attention! Basics. More sure you understand the basics. You'll always be second rate if you just rely on instinct. You. Damn it. Shut up. Then... If you understand what I just said, come see me. When that time comes, I will fight you once again. Don't forget! <laughs> you better not forget what you just said. My desire to win is pretty crazy. I'll show you my serious side! I won't give up to that beat shot. We're wobbling steps to kind of like However... Beach. She felt that fiercely with just her own style, how ominous her answer was That numb. girl! She's probably, She's probably gonna get even stronger. Yeah, you're probably right. What kind of conversation is this? Oh, shit. <laughs> and you fight the stronger <laughs> you get. That's what being a battle lover is all about. What kind of conclusion is that? This is a beach? Wow. Look at it. Very spacious, very... Interesting. I like it. I like it a lot. Um... Why is there Monokuma? Huh? Are you serious? I found Monokuma just sitting there. That was weird. Oh, speaking of that... Ah, oh, shit, I gotta check the pet. Fuck. Pet's fine. Okay, cool. Oh, 
You do? Basics are the foundation for everything. No, I get that, but training that we resemble an actual fight might be fun. But just be careful not to get hurt, both of you. Impossible! Injury an athlete would disgrace me as a team manager. Okay, cool. Yeah. I'm gonna check the beach house, okay? I thought this was a beach house since it's near the edge of the beach, but it looks pretty luxurious. I guess it's a cel celebrity style beach house. <laughs> this door leads to the beach. I guess for now I have to look around here more. A lot of drinks here, like water and coffee. Most of these drinks have colored dyes. Oh shit. I mean, when most of these drinks have colored dyes, that might be bad for your health. Can we drink these for free? There's a trash can, but I don't have anything I need to throw away. Hmm. Holy shit! There's a closet! Looks like this is the closet. And the inside is... It's like a small storage room. It's almost like a walk-in closet. Just surfboards arranged on the shelf, but I'm not into surfing, but it doesn't really matter to me. There's a fancy-looking bench that looks like something you see at the resort. Shower room. It looks like this is the shower room. There's a notice on the door. Judging by the illustration, it looks like it's being repaired or under construction, something like that. This door leads to the road by the tunnel. Okay. Yo! Hey, doesn't this feel awesome? Like a celebrity's pad or something. This shower is out of order, but the ambience is nice. And the fridge is stuffed with loads of drinks. <laughs> Plus, the beach outside feels so private. It's awesome. Could be a nude beach, too. Compared to urban seas that are full of trash and debris, this place is completely different. We're the only ones on this island, anyway, so anywhere we go is a private beach. Hey, hey! I'm sure shy my... I'm so shy my dreams like That's that. right! More importantly, why don't we splash around at this private beach? <laughs> awesome! Totally awesome! Splashing around at such a gorgeous beach is really the best! He is usually a happy go lucky self. Well, I guess that's one of his good qualities. Miss Sonia! <sighs> I if Miss Sonia would come, too. I want to see Miss Sonia in a bikini. And creepiness level went to 500. You can't! Why not? Whoa! Hey! Why not? Are you trying to interfere with my love affair with Miss Sonia? I won't forgive you! Changing in the beach house is prohibited. It would be a bad if shameful peeking occurred. So you mean changing here isn't allowed? Not going to the beach itself? Huh? Then I'll just have to come here after changing. I'm never gonna give her up. We might let her down though. Got it? Anyway, breaking the rules is not allowed. Also, playing is fine. But please focus on your studies too. What if you can't stop these hormone teenagers, girl? Eventually, sex will happen. You guys? Where? Where's the rule breaker? I'll beat the crap out of them. No questions asked. Holy shit, Monokuma's packing. Yeah. He's here. You. What are you holding? <sighs> a machine gun, obviously. He... Little breakers will be shot to death. That's just coming. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey! It's common sense. We're it looks like we're under a military dictatorship. <laughs> shoot something. I know I'm not allowed to, but I really want to shoot something right now. <laughs> Control yourself! Hold it in! I have Hold it in! Willpower. 
power, so I endure it, no matter the cost of the day someone breaks the rules. Um... As you can see, it's very dangerous, so please refrain from changing at the beach house. Ah. Well, Monami would be like giving you a slap on the wrist. Monokuma is gonna go and slice that hand off. Ah. Wow, that was totally bizarre. Man, they're annoying. Yeah, I feel tired all of a sudden. Uh, which reminds me. When we mentioned Nikitu at the restaurant, Kazuichi looked pretty unsettled about something. I guess I should ask him about that. Reminds me. I have something to ask you. Huh? What? It's about Nagito. Whoa! I haven't seen that guy all day. Do you know where he is? Well... I don't know. Seriously, don't ask me. <laughs> Who cares about that crazy-ass bastard? We need to search this island first and foremost. That must be the way to escape. How annoying! Let's well, end all annoying talk right here. That's it. All done. He ended the conversation very forcibly, just as I thought. He definitely is hiding something. Hajime! Chiaki, what happened? Well? I'm not letting everyone else know too, but can you come to the Ichin Ruins on this island right away? You can, right? Right away, okay? Hurry up! Based on her pushy tone, she might have found something, some kind of clue. Guess I should head over to the Ichin Ruins. I just realized Whoa. something. It's Hope's Peak Academy. The ancient ruins are Hope's. It's Hope's Peak Academy. This is Hope's Peak. Can we explore in it? I want to explore in it. I want to whole explore. <laughs> if you have, if you never seen Funhouse, you found my whorehouse. Would you like to horror explore? <laughs> what the heck is this? Such a gigantic thing. However, it is clearly faded. It looks like an ancient ruin. Well, it seems perhaps an actual ancient ruin. What's going on? How should I say this? Does the, don't you think this building resembles a school? I just realized that, you know? I just realized as soon as it came up, I was like, oh, that's Hope's Peak Academy. School? Now that you mention it, I don't know how, but I do see what she means. Surprise! There might be a resemblance to Hope's Peak Academy. There are a lot of similar looking buildings. It's just a coincidence that this ruin looks similar. It's a coincidence, right? Hmm. You found something, right, Chiaki? What did you find? Hey, bastard! I have a fucking cut you if that is it. This is a waste of time. <laughs> I didn't know you were also here. That bitch of a kid told me so I finally came. <laughs> did you maybe find a way to get off this island? Nope. Nope, nothing like that. Aww. Then who cares? I should have played in the bath with Mahiru more. Let me ask. Then what in the world did you find? Chiaki found something. I wonder who it is. The door! What is this, Ichiro? There's a strange ambience to it. I should listen to what Chiaki has to say first. Look, it's the door! Oh my god! Well, let's hear what Shaki has to say. What did you find? If it's not a way off this island, does it have something to do with this island's secret? Hmm... About that... I don't know. Hey! What do you mean you don't know? Hmm. It's like it doesn't belong with a building like this. I keep thinking about it and it feels unnatural. Um, it's like a comic book originally about a oh, baseball. 
becoming a side-scrolling action game. It's unnatural like that. That's a little harder to understand. See? Look, that door over there. Door? It's hard to make out from all the dust, but this is the door you mean, right? That's right! Yeah, it looks like that's the door to the ruin. Hey! So what's wrong with this door? Can you go inside? Um... Before we attempt to go inside, let's try brushing off some of the dust and clearing some of these roots root things off the door. If you do, I'm pretty sure you'll understand what I mean by unnatural. For now. I don't really understand, but I guess we should try what she says. You're right. As she actually said, we brush off the dust and clear the roots roots that were stuck into the door. Then you see this dead skeleton remains of 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 the of the characters of the first game. <laughs> oh god. Now I'm scared if we do. And then... What is this? Door. It doesn't feel like it belongs to an ancient ruin. What's going on? It's like a door from a sci-fi movie. Don't you think it definitely doesn't fit with an ancient ruin? And what is this symbol on the door? Oh? It looks like it's Japanese. Oh! Oh, you're totally right. Um... I'm sorry, but if it's just my misunderstanding, to me, it looks like it says Mirei, or future. Future? Bastard! Ah. Hey, who cares about a symbol on the door? More importantly, how are you opening it? What's inside? Hey! It looks like there's a liquid crystal display next to the door. To do it, to do it. Hey. Oh, right. It must be the key to open the door. It's probably set to open when you type the password. Yes, yes! I think all might high and mighty, so what's next? It's obviously impossible to get put in the password without any hands. <laughs> ah, are you saying a normal person can't open it by a Yakuza can? That's the way. Shut up! Oh, if we just type whatever, we might get right. Hold it! I think we should wait. Doesn't that seem dangerous? Huh? What do you mean dangerous? Oh, look! See? The thing next to the panel doesn't really look like a gun. In fact, that's totally a gun. But that's a so... gun! It is. It's probably very dangerous. It's possible you might get shot if you mess up the password, right? Yeah. <sighs> so... It can't be helped. Looks like a bear if we don't mess with it for now. <laughs> you totally freaked you out. Shut the hell up! Hmm. But still, a building that looks like an ancient ruin with a door that looks like it's from a sci fi film. It's definitely unnatural. This is probably an important place. Hmm. Important place, huh? The problem is, how is it important? <laughs> um. Huh? You're yeah, a bit quiet. I'll beat you up! You guys know what this building too, right? Just be honest with us. I'm sorry! No, I have no, I have no idea at all. <laughs> I don't know either. Um... For now, everyone should focus on gathering the hope stack and... I won't be fooled! Hey, there's no way you guys don't know. Don't just show up and tell me about some lousy lies. Um... I think that's probably the one to cover that good test, right? As I thought, you guys were hiding it on purpose, right? Hey! Hey, don't talk like we're equals, you trashy bi- Oh my god, I hate this girl. Oh, I'm sorry! You nasty pig bars! Oh my! I'm just, I'm just I'm sorry. <gasps> is it possible that there is a connection between this door and the reason this island is uninhabited? For example, this place might be a shelter, and there might be natives inside. Hey! Is something happening that would make them hide in the shelter? If so, we are all screwed. You're getting all riled up! Mm, several possibilities cross my mind. Hmm. That looks like there's no way to confirm it yet. That door is really sturdy. But that in material sense, more essential than that. Huh? 
what are you saying? Hey, um... For instance, even though Mono Me and I can come and go as we please, we can't enter what's beyond that door. Oh, uh... You can't go inside too? Does that mean you're in the same as me? Hey, keep your tongue in your mouth! Oh, God! Yeah. My body can't handle a supersonic meteor rush like that! Well, now. Now, I have shut up my sister with a fantastic Pegasus Meteor Fest. Odd name for a fucking fight move. This is the mystery of Jabberwock Island, a mystery that even one of me and I can tell. Yeah. <laughs> I have my expectations for you guys. One day you'll be able to solve that mystery. <laughs> That seems easy though. All we gotta do is remember what the black and white tonic you said before. Why are there 16 of you? Total 15 students from Home Speed Academy will bring us a conquest. I got it! That's right. There's probably a trainer I don't even know about hiding among the group. I know! There's a trainer among us. That's what that ugly Tanuki said before. Fine, fine! Call me ugly and a Tanuki. That's kind of a silly name. Don't depress me in the slightest. Hello! He's totally depressed. <laughs> but there's a traitor. They probably know how to open the door, right? And there's probably folks that are a way to contact the outside world beyond that thing. Uh! Maybe the other people in Monoku and Monami is hiding there. That is a possibility as, as well. But do you really think there's a trigger on my life? No shit! Of course there is! Who the hell is it? Hurry up, I got back! That's... There isn't. There's no trigger anywhere. Hey, bastard! Monokuma, what about you? You're the one who mentioned it. <laughs> you fiend. That's so funny. Hey! Hey! Hey, Chess, have you always ever wondered an organization called World Ender? World Ender? That's not the organization that Junko is working for, right? You! I'm the one asking you a question. Don't just change the subject. Come on! I understand why you don't want to death. And you're... Blender is such an embarrassing name. So embarrassing that... Only a middle school students, no wait, elementary school students would come up with it. Yeah! But then he was unavailable because that organization actually exists. So what? <laughs> it's literally what it says. I don't believe it! Those guys ended the world! <laughs> ended the world? Hey, um... That's not an overstatement. A metaphor. You know, those guys really did end the world. Yes. It took like about two... It took about like... It took about two Watchmen adaptations to do that. Don't you think... Don't you think it's appropriate to call them World Ender? So basically... You mean they are a terrorist organization? Hmm... Might be accurate, but only losers are terrorists. They mash to win and they become heroes. <laughs> that sense, they're more like heroes. How are they? They're heroes. They are the heroes who ended the world. What's going on? So what? Don't say things that don't make sense. Don't tell me you're going to say this organization is the one playing us through all this crap. Mm. Old Ender, you saying that you and Monami are also members of that organization? Who knows? Who knows? The only thing I can tell you is, the organization that the traitor is working for, the ones who brought you to this island, what? Old Ender is behind it all. Are you kidding me? What are you? Are we being targeted by a horrifying organization like that? Don't panic. This isn't a made-up story to trick us, like when he said we lost our school memories. 
I can't suspend my disbelief for something as ridiculous as World Ender. There's no way that organization or that traitor exists. Stay back! Monokuma, I shall listen to you sprout nonsense all you want while I put a sp of a cigar smoke at your lifeless body. That's I was kind of you guys informed. Are you calling me a liar? What the heck? If you're gonna keep acting like this, I'll do this and that to your various body parts. Silence! I'm telling you the truth. The world under organization is the final boss of this island. Plus one of these members is hiding among you guys. That's why you gotta go find the trainer and kill the dead. Hey! You better stop. I'm gonna punish you! Of me. Big bird of fine trash like you need to be punished. No! Don't put my... Oh, my ears are gonna come off. <laughs> Monokuma and Monomi departed from the area, leaving the rest of us dazed and confused. What was that just now? What's going on? Is there anybody who understood what he was talking about? Um... Not a clue. <laughs> hey, hey! For now, since the sun is setting, we should just go home for the day. I think it's a waste of time for us to keep thinking about this. You're probably right. Hey! But it's getting dark soon, so... Going home might be a better idea. Let's just call it a day. After exploring the new island, all we have uncovered are more mysteries. As we lowered our heads and bemoaned that reality, we began heading back to our cottages. I'm dead tired from walking around all day. Jeez, I don't know what the hell's going on. But it's starting to make my head hurt. Ancient ruins, strange doors, traitors, and a world under. I have no idea what's going on anymore. And I don't even feel anxious about it. I guess I should go to sleep for now. With that, I laid my exhausted body onto the bed. I close my eyes. I don't like this! My least favorite food is definitely crab. I don't like shrimp, apples, tomatoes, and seasoned... and... Seasoned what? Seasoned trout trials. I don't like red foods at all. The well, red foods are red because they have crab inside of them. It's actually a conspiracy by the crab industry to try to make me overcome my di disgust. There's no way, Fall that I will never, ever eat red foods. You see, our society is full of various hidden conspiracies that are closer than you might think. Please look forward to the next Monokuma Theater!